Okay, so here we are. It's day two out of three of the install. Day one was actually pretty uneventful. It was a lot of housekeeping. It was taking off shipping brackets. It was uh, putting the pads. There's eight pads that this machine sits on forward in place. So the leveling process, all that little stuff, and also cleaning. So this comes from overseas. It crosses the Pacific. So there's lots of cosmoline, a corrosion inhibitor that's all over it. It's just, there was nothing really to see. But today we have power to it. We already have air, it's turned on. The technician is just dialing everything in. And I wanna be cutting material on day four, but we'll see how today goes. So when it came to power, one of the things that caught me off guard is how power hungry this machine is. So it requires a 250 amp breaker. Now inside of an electrical panel, they don't make breakers that size. They make breakers, but they're more of a, a full size, like a main disconnect. So what we had to do is we opted to use one of the transformers. Now the backstory on this transformer is there was a guy that was closing out his uh, electrical supply house. He came to my shop with three transformers. I was gonna buy two of them. And I made him an offer he couldn't refuse. I bought all three thinking someday with the growth of the company, I'm gonna want an extra transformer. I did not expect that transformer to be used within the first few months of us being here. So what we did, we pulled the 480 down to this transformer, transforms it to 208, and this can put out a little bit over 300 amps of power. So from there, we went into a fused disconnect. So a fuse is essentially an old school breaker. So with our three phases, that goes from the transformer through the fuse disconnect to the machine. And now the machine has a dedicated transformer and a fuse disconnect. Now in the future, what we can do is we can split this off and have a panel that we can use that extra 50 or 100 amps for something else. But for now, this has been a lifesaver. Really happy that I bought this one extra with such a great deal in place. All right, so we got the machine hooked up, it's commissioned, we've gone through training, and we're really wrapping our minds around how to program this machine for great success and confidence using Fusion 360.